Hello, you're watching Holgor's Beer Reviews. Just crack open this Carlsberg and then I move the camera and then I start it over. Here's the pour. Beer Advocate gives this beer 70. They say it's okay. It's a very yellowish color. Very carbonated. It has quite a few streams of carbonation. Beer Advocate and the bros say 70 okay. 70 out of 100. Um, beer Advocate, or the, uh, the average is, well, 3.01. And as I, it, it just looks just like uh, your typical Heineken, St. Pauli, your typical Euro Lager. Cheers. Oh, I didn't say what it smells like. Yeah, like any other green bottle beer. Oh, wow. It's not just like a Heineken, because a Heineken usually has more of a skunk to it. But this is actually very pleasant, very clean, very crisp and refreshing. What's a fine beer? Here's a couple uh, user submitted reviews. Great for a pint at the bar, overall all right beer. I personally prefer something like Harp or even uh, a Heineken. I also would go in pubs and bars sometimes, beggars can't be choosers. Uh, I don't agree with that person at all. Um, let's see, 3.79 out of 5. This is not really a German style Pilsner, it's, it's not supposed to be. It's a Scandinavian style, the best taste is what is found in Denmark. Straight from the brewery and not jacked up for travel. Great go-to on a hot summer day or at the beach. Actually, this is very similar to um, Dos Equis. It doesn't have much of a, of a taste in the mouth. I got, let me adjust that. There we go. Uh, Dos Equis, it doesn't leave very much taste in the mouth. It's very clean, crisp, refreshing. Um, and they're on both very similar in price. Um, I believe this can was, oh yeah, this can was $2.99, so that is a little bit more expensive than your typical beer. In fact, this is a smaller can, and for a 24 ounce, because this is only six, 17 ounces, yeah, so it's kind of expensive beer. Uh, for $2.79 you get 24 ounce of, of uh, Dos Equis. So yeah, this is kind of expensive. All in all, is it worth trying out? Sure, yeah, it's definitely worth trying out. Is it worth like getting all the time? Not in my, in my opinion, no. If you like this, that's great, but uh, it just it tastes just like Dos Equis. It tastes similar to Heineken, but a lot smoother. Um, I don't know, Heineken's okay, but that taste can work with you or work against you, and it, it seems to get spoiled really quickly. Like, Heineken, you don't want to get warmed up at all. You don't want it to get, I don't know, it seems like one of the most temperamental beers there is. That and Roller Lock. But yeah, overall, I'll give this a uh, neat out of 10. It's good, but it's, it's, a simple goodness, it's not something you can really, I don't know, it's not something that tastes better than this, and something this, some, something that, blah, 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 blah. it's just a really simple, tastes like Dos Equis. Um, Pilsner beer. Uh, that's interesting, the smell is a little bit skunkier than most beers that come in a green bottle. I didn't. Doesn't smell doesn't smell bad at all. It just sm smells clean. Um, yeah. So overall, ten eight out of ten. But that's on taste. If I was rating on the price, I'd bring it down a point. So yeah, it is damn expensive. Where I found it, three dollars for 
18 ounces. It was, it was at the liquor store though, so I wouldn't really expect a good deal at the liquor store. But yeah. Carlsberg. It's alright. Um, it's definitely uh, thin and light and refreshing without actually being a light beer. I never actually said what the ABV is. I believe it's 5%. Yep, 5%. So, 5% beer. It's good, but it ain't worth a second. It's it's worth it's worth trying out, but not worth continuously forking out eight. I mean, three dollars for 17 ounces. That's ridiculous. I mean, for two dollars more, you get a six pack of your typical whatever beer for cheap. But you know, sometimes you don't want a cheap beer. Sometimes you want something fancy. So uh, yeah, that's my review. That's my review.